This is a Quantum 6 Edge 2.0 I-Level power chair. This power chair is fully loaded. It only has 15 miles, so it was used for a couple months. 15 miles, which is practically brand new. Uh, fantastic color. Uh, this is one of my favorite colors. It is fully loaded. It has the 10 inch seat lift, the electric tilt, the electric recline, the electric legs. It has other features which we'll cover. But the first thing we're going to cover is the electric seat lift. So you can work the seat lift through the box that's over here. Or you can work it through the joystick. Since we have the joystick on this side, I'm going to put the joystick in the mode of the seat lift. So by doing that, I just have to push this button on the left forward. Now we're on speed four. In the fourth time, you'll have the picture of the seat. Whatever is yellow is what's going to move. So if I move the joystick, now we have the legs. I'm going to go back to the, just the bottom, which is just the seat. Push the joystick back, and now you've got your 10-inch seat lift going up. This is called the eye level seat lift. The nice thing about this seat lift, once it's elevated, this chair will still drive at almost half its speed, which is unheard of. So I'm going to put the chair in drive on speed four, just to show you. Of course, you wouldn't be driving on speed four in the house. But now I'm on speed four, and I can still drive this chair. I can't get it to full speed, but you can see, you can see how nice that is. So that's one of the features of this eye level this is one of the few power chairs that will drive at that speed with the seat elevated. Most of them will drive at one mile an hour, one and a half mile an hour. Once we have the seat elevated, let's talk about the base. Over here we've got 14 inch non-skid wheels with uh, aluminum rims. We've got caster wheels in the front, caster wheels in the back. We've got solid anchor points on both sides. There's two of them on each side. So if you need to tie your chair to your lift or to your van, this is where you would hook them up. You've got a motor for each wheel. If you need to put this chair in neutral, turn your power off on your chair, and then you would put both motors, you would push the lever down, and now your wheel is in neutral, so you can roll your chair around. Now this chair weighs 350 pounds, so uh, it's not like you're pushing a lightweight power chair, but it, you'll be able to push it around. Push it back up, and you're back in gear. So here you're looking at the 10 inch seat lift right there. The next thing we're going to talk about is the electric tilt. So I've got it set up for tilting right now. So I'm going to push the joystick back. And now you've got your electric tilt going back. So while, it's, while the seat is tilting, I'm going to talk to you about the swing away joystick. So this joystick can be swung away all the way away from the front arm. So if you want to go to a dining table, you can do that. Or if you get to the dining table, you don't want to swing away. You can also pull the arm out of the way. So you can get yourself right under the dining table. The joystick can be put on the right, which where it's at, or it can be put on the left. No problem at all doing that. So this is your electric tilt. The next thing we're going to talk about is the electric recline. So since I'm doing it through the joystick, I can do two functions at one time through the joystick. So I'm going to do the legs coming up and the back going back at the same time. If you're doing your function through the box back here, you can only do one at a time. So if I push this back, you'll see the legs coming up and you'll see the back reclining. Uh, these legs are adjustable. We can adjust them in any position, any length that you need. So they're still electric, but depending how tall you are, or if you're a shorter person, we can adjust these legs. See the legs going out? There you go. They went out about an inch or two further. So this is your electric recline and your electric legs. And on here, you've got a custom backboard here to hold your legs in. This can be tightened up, and it keeps your legs from falling off the foot plate. So these are guards right here. And you have foot plate that flips up also if you need to get out. So this is your electric recline and your electric legs. Now we're going to turn the chair around a little bit. We're going to talk about the suspension. You can see the suspension right here in front. This is a heavy duty suspension. It can be adjusted with the ring in the bottom of the suspension. There's a ring that you can turn to tighten up or loosen up the suspension. There's two of these shocks in front. And if I turn the chair around, there's also one in the back right here with the same suspension for the back legs. And you can also adjust it here or loosen it up. That's your back suspension. Back here we've got hooks. So if you want to carry a backpack, you want to put a backpack, you would hook your backpack through here and it would hang down over here. You've got the support for the backpack here. You've got an attendant control here. By switching the mode right here, I can switch it and now I can drive the chair myself from here. I can do all the function from here. Uh, I can do all the function driving it, tilting the seat, raising the seat. 
So this is called a tenon control. It's already on the chair. It's back here. I'm going to turn it back off. And I'm going to turn the power back on up front because once you turn the power here, the power in the front switches over to here. So we've got the power back on the front. Now this is a mid-wheel drive chair, meaning that the wheels are in the, the drive wheels are in the middle. So this chair turns around its own length. Uh, so if you put a box behind the chair and a box in front of this foot plate, I would be able to turn this chair like this. Let me pull the speed up a little bit. I would be able to turn this chair all day long like this. So, this is a mid-wheel drive chair. The arms do go up. You do have a safety belt on here. You've got a nice $300 plus Robo cushion. This is an air cushion. And this cushion can be adjusted. There's a valve here. There's a plastic pump that you get with the cushion. You can just put your pump, your, your plastic pump right on the valve right here. Open the valve up and you can put air in the cushion. So you can adjust the cushion, and I think this is a quad cushion where you get two pumps, you get, you get two valves, so you can adjust the, the back or the front, depending uh, what, uh, how much firmness you want on the cushion. So there's two different positioning in this cushion. This is one of the most expensive cushions. This is an 18 by 20 deep. So this right now is set up by 18 wide, 8, 20 deep. If you need to see bigger or smaller, just give us a call. We can work with you on that. The cushion, if you don't like this cushion, you just take it off and put your own cushion on it. If you want to have a gel cushion or a foam cushion or your own personal cushion, just drop it on here. That's what these chairs are made for. Nice contoured back. Great suspension. As I said, this chair has 15 miles, so it's practically new. When you want to charge the batteries on this chair, take your charger. Plug it to the bottom of your joystick, and as soon as the light turns green on your charger, you're fully charged. You don't have to worry about overcharging this chair. The charger will recognize when the batteries are full, and it'll stop charging automatically. So, if you want an orange power looking chair with only 15 miles, practically new condition, with the 10 inch seat lift that still drives at 3, 3.5 three miles an hour with a seat elevated, with electric tilt, electric recline, electric leg, and I call these fully loaded. With the attendant control in the back, swing away joystick, uh, safety belt, Roho cushion, this would be a really nice one to look at. And this chair will go six miles an hour also at full speed, six miles an hour. And you'll see when I drive it outside, you'll see the suspension. These chairs have an incredible smooth ride. So I would definitely look at this one. It's a real nice power chair. Again, six miles an hour, super comfortable, luxury chair. Uh, you can't beat these chairs for the ride, the suspension. This is a great chair. This is Mark with Mark's Mobility. We are a family owned business for over 20 years. Thank you for watching this presentation. We have several other models available. If you have any questions, please call the number below 800 677 6293. Thank you again for watching.